Members opposite should the be ashamed. The Honourable Member's time has expired. I call the Honourable. The question is that the House do now adjourn. I call the Honourable Member for Robertson. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Recently, I was privileged to attend an album launch of the Coast Sessions. It's a double CD of fantastic hit songs from famous artists living on the Central Coast, along with some undiscovered original songs that I have no doubt include a few future hits from future music stars in the making as well. The album's a joyous mix of well-known artists now living on the Central Coast and also of young musicians whose talent remains undiscovered so far but whose great potential shines through on this CD. The launch was held at a famous music venue on the Central Coast, Lazotte's at Kingcumber, and I was privileged to hear some of these musicians live on stage and in action. Madam Speaker, they were simply fabulous. There were anthems such as Joe Coffey's song, Stand Tall, Stand Up For What You Believe In, a great reggae mix that had us all caught up singing along to his engaging and entertaining performance. Chrissy Kay's song, Goodbye, is another highlight on the album. But for me, it was not so much goodbye as hello, because I had a great chance to catch up with Chrissy, Chrissy King and her sister Eliza, who sang backing vocals with her on the night. In fact, Chrissy reminded me that I taught her in history, in her history class, when I was a teacher at my old school in Narara some 20-odd years ago. Now, of course, she's in the process of making her own piece of music history as well. Another young local singer, Daisy Sherwood Miller delivered a great live version of her pop song, Does This Move Make You Tingle? And just for a moment, I thought perhaps Bob Dylan had appeared on stage when the irresistible Dr. Good Vibe performed his original song, Price Tag. Other local artists who were on the CD and who were just amazing on the night included, include Jess Hind, Kelly Griffith, Jake Folbig, Alicia Brock, Ellen Mara, Sarah Lancer, Amber Mercury, The Smoking Mirrors, The New Regulars, Annabel Clark, and Liz Kidney. We also heard Hannah Smith perform her original track, Ghost of You. Her voice is truly mesmerising, and I'm sure she is one of our future country music stars. Madam Speaker, when I watched Countdown in the 80s growing up, I don't think I ever imagined that one day I'd get to see Central Coast-based star Billy Field perform live on stage as I did that night at Lazotte's. Billy's debut, debut album, Bad Habits, of course, shot to the top of the Australian top charts, and his title track is one of the songs on the Coast Session CD. Madam Speaker, we owe this success to Innovate Music. It's a group of locals determined to make the Central Coast a place where musical talent is fostered, where creativity abounds, and where excellence flourishes. The album launch was really made possible thanks to the leadership of Chairman of Innovate Music, David Bacon, whose vision and drive for this project helped to make the record a reality. My congratulations must also go to Graham, King, Graham Baker, Chris King, Dexter Moore and Grant Wormsley, and a special thanks to Brian Lazotte and his wife Judy, whose place at Kingcumber and now, of course, also Madam Speaker in DY and, and Newcastle, are renowned as superb live music and entertainment venues with fantastic food to go with it. Innovate Music is a genuine, vibrant grassroots initiative. In their determination to source the very best talent from the Central Coast, a live judging event was held last November offering dozens of local musicians a shot at being included on this album. Fourteen local artists were selected in this way, with the remaining two performers being selected in a People's Choice event in December last year. But the heart and soul of this project, and so much of our homegrown musical talent on the Central Coast, is Rod, comes from Rod McCormack and Gina Jeffries. The guitar player you hear in the Coast Sessions is Rod McCormack, an outstanding musician who's played on a number of hit records over the years. I heard his band jamming on stage and their spontaneous improvisation was actually second to none. We actually could have been listening to a performance at the Arias. Gina Jeffries, of course, has also been reigning supreme at the top of her industry since her debut single, Two Stars Fell, shot to the top of the charts in 1993. Gina's a four-time golden, golden Guitar winner and she's become one of our most in-demand performers in the country. Many of the artists featuring on the CD were actually trained by Gina, and you can hear the benefits of her masterclass and the depth of the voices and the skills of the musicians. musicians. I've actually got copies of this landmark double album in my office, and if anybody would like to purchase a copy, I'll be playing it off, often in my, music and, in my office reception, and I invite you to come and listen. 
not just because it is great music, Madam Speaker, but because it promotes the people, the talent, the opportunity and the creativity on the Central Coast. The Coast Sessions is about creating more cultural and economic opportunity for the Central Coast to the tune of world-class talent and the songs of some of the best musicians.